Um, let's talk politics. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I'm listening. I'm all ears. Where are we? I'm terrified. I like live in daily terror, I feel like, where I'm really stuck in. And that's like being in this loop of looking at terrible things that are happening in the world and then processing them in negative ways of like just not not dealing with them. Like I don't and, and, and realizing like I feel very out of touch with a way to affect change on a broader way or to fight against that. Yeah. Transgressions, since you're a transcendent being, you don't know how to transcend them. You don't know how to get into them and, and elevate them. Sure. Yeah. yeah. And I feel like that it's out of my control and that I'm just like waiting for a bomb to go off or something mm -hmm. like that, you know, or like waiting for World War III to happen. Mm -hmm. And I know that sounds ridiculous, um, mm -hmm. but it, it, you know, I, I think some of it's like needing to cut myself off of social media a little more often too. Mm -hmm. um, but the world at large, especially even as a parent, terrifies me, and I feel like ineffectual, inability to mm -hmm. uh, change anything in mm -hmm, that. Mm -hmm. To come into relation with your soul, uh, you must come into a relationship with healing. And I hear the healer talking that is sort of at uh, a crossroads. She doesn't know how to heal the ills of the world. And this really causes you mental and emotional strife. Am I? A hundred percent, yeah. Is it just in America? Is it the world at large? It's the world at large, okay. for sure. I mean, that is, you know, it's not becoming more and more real because it's always been real, but just that, like, it gets closer and closer and closer, it feels like, you know? And I, I don't know how to escape the negativity that I see all around me constantly and turn that into empowerment or, like, a way to, to do something with it. Mm-hmm.